Manny Pacquiao is set to make an epic return to the ring, and he's ready to come back stronger than ever. Yep, you heard that right. Pac-Man is getting help from the best of the best for his comeback, and I'm talking about the man himself, Mike Tyson. Mike and Manny have been hitting the gym together, and some pros aren't too happy about it. Terrence Crawford and Floyd Mayweather have strong opinions on this new friendship. There's a lot to talk about in this video, so without further ado, let's dive straight into Terrence and Floyd reacting to Manny Pacquiao training with Mike Tyson. Get this, Manny has got it all planned out for 2024. He wants to come back and do as much as he can before he's forced to call it quits with the sport and for real this time. Pac-Man has a shiny list of opponents he wants to fight before hanging up his gloves and Terrence Crawford and Floyd Mayweather top that list. Yeah, both athletes are set to step into the ring with Manny this year, so it didn't come as a shock when they freaked out over Mike's involvement in his training. Hear me out, we all remember the wonders Iron Mike did for Francis Ngannou, right? He helped the athlete make his major jump from MMA to boxing and didn't just introduce him to the sport, but made him a force to be reckoned with in the ring. There's no denying that Francis made the undefeated heavyweight world champion, Tyson Fury, look like a fool in the ring and he could have easily taken the win home if the judges scored the fight fairly. Now just imagine, if Mike could do that to a newbie boxer, one can only imagine how much he can help Manny, who's already a boxing legend. And that's exactly why Terrence and Floyd are losing it. Terrence and Floyd don't want to step into the ring with a beast and risk losing. I mean, who would want to sign up for that, right? Floyd and Mike have been caught up together in more controversies than I can count, and it's safe to say they aren't on the best of terms. So when he saw his longtime rival Manny get into the ring with Mike, Money Mayweather was pissed. He said that it's not surprising for him to see Manny ask Mike for help since he can't help himself. Mayweather said that Manny couldn't give him a challenge in the ring, no matter who he asked for help from, Mike Tyson or Tyson Fury. There's no boxer out there who can make Manny recover from the damage Floyd did in 2015. And that's not all. Terrence is in the same boat. Yep. Bud decided to share his two cents on Mike and Manny training together, and he isn't too happy about it either. Get this. Bud said that Mike helping Manny isn't fair to the athletes Manny steps into the ring with. Now we all know he's talking about himself. Terrence and Manny are set to step into the ring together later in 2024 for an epic clash in the ring, but Terrence is having second thoughts now. Come on, he's the top dog of boxing. Why would he want to step into the ring and lose to a retired boxer who's been out of the ring for years? If anything, Manny should be rusty by now. Get this, Manny's been out of the ring ever since his humiliating loss to your Dennis Ugas in 2021. That loss must have rubbed him the wrong way because the athlete decided to take some time off, leaving boxing fans with absolutely nothing but internet feuds from his side. But this guy is ready to fight again, and why wouldn't he be with Mike Tyson on his side? Manny is finally making a comeback, and fans are buzzing with excitement for his return to the ring. He's eyeing potential opponents, and one name that stands out is Terrence Crawford. No surprise there. Bud's on everyone's hit list, and who wouldn't want to face the top dog in boxing for a career-defining fight? For Manny and Terrence to square off, they'll need to agree on a catchweight, and we all know how tricky that can be. But Manny has it all figured out. He's setting the terms. He's adamant about the fight happening at 147 pounds, and he's not willing to compromise on that. Considering their overlapping careers in various weight divisions, Manny moving up from flyweight to welterweight, and Crawford fighting in lightweight, junior welterweight, and welterweight, it's a clash that's been a long time coming. Despite the intersecting weight classes, a catchweight is the way to go for this epic showdown. Manny is clear about wanting to give fans a super fight in his comeback, and he's not sitting around waiting for Bud. While there's no official word from Crawford's camp yet, we'll have to wait and see how this unfolds. Personally, I don't see any reason why Bud wouldn't be up for this challenge. He proved himself against Errol Spence Jr. in July 2023, and has since become one of the top fighters in the sport. However, one epic win isn't enough to secure his spot at the pinnacle. He needs to step into the ring again, prove his worth and show he's not just on top, but here to stay. But we can't say for sure whether he's going to stay up there because this fight has gotten a whole lot more challenging ever since Mike offered help to Manny. Manny and Mike's friendship isn't too surprising. These two go way back. 
Yep, Manny and Mike share a deep history, with Manny consistently showing immense respect for the boxing legend. So, it's not surprising that Mike Tyson is throwing his support behind Manny in this upcoming fight, especially considering the opponent is none other than Floyd Mayweather, someone who has taken numerous shots at Tyson throughout his career. Mike Tyson's recent boxing gym deal paved the way for him to become Manny's trainer. Tyson, nicknamed Iron Mike, has been collaborating closely with Saudi Arabia in recent months, and the benefits are numerous. First, he served as Francis's head trainer for the Tyson Fury bout, not only earning handsomely for his training, but also for promoting the fight. As part of the deal, Tyson inaugurated a new training center in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia, and guess who attended the grand opening? Manny Pacquiao, of course. The signs of their collaboration were evident when Pac-Man decided to extend his stay in Saudi Arabia after the Tyson Fury vs. Francis bout and visited Tyson's gym. A viral video clip captured their warm embrace, suggesting a partnership in the works. Though their conversation was brief, keen observers suspected it might have been about Manny's upcoming bout with Floyd, which hadn't been officially announced at that time. Pacquiao has been hinting at a return to the ring after wrapping up political and business commitments. Despite his foray into other fields, his true calling remains in the boxing ring. Meanwhile, Floyd Mayweather, although retired for many years, couldn't resist the allure of the ring. He's been engaging in matches with YouTubers and influencers, creating quite a buzz in the fight world. However, his upcoming rematch with Manny marks a significant shift, as it will be his first time facing a real boxer in a long time. Mayweather, known for seeking easy money, is about to step into the ring against a formidable opponent, presenting a real challenge beyond what he's accustomed to in recent years. Mike is one training Manny, so we don't take his words with grains of salt when he talks about the athlete's progress. He's the one who's watching Manny's moves in the ring, and if you ask him, they're smoother than ever. So Mike Tyson's out here claiming he's in the sickest shape of his life. It's been a hot minute since we've seen Manny throw down in the ring, and some peeps might expect a bit of rust, you know? But if you're vibing with Tyson's words, that assumption's way off. Iron Mike straight up says Manny Pacquiao is far from rusty. Tyson's like, nah man, Manny's not just ready, he's playing the game smarter than ever. Tyson's got the crowd hyped, promising fans an even more epic performance from the Filipino legend. In a recent spill the tea moment, the boxing icon spilled that he's got a whole game plan cooked up for Manny. Tyson's claiming he's clocked all of Floyd Mayweather's weak spots and is about to drop some knowledge bombs on Manny to capitalize on them. This collab between Tyson and Manny is more than a comeback. It's a shot at redemption for Manny, fulfilling a quest that's been going down for years. Terrence and Floyd better get ready for the toughest fights of their career, cause Manny isn't gonna come to play. Guess we'll just have to wait and see how it all plays out. So, what are your thoughts on Manny and Mike training together? Do you think it's fair for Floyd and Terrence? Make sure to let us know in the comments. So there you have it, Fight World. That's all I have for you today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and comment below. I'll be back with more fight news, and until then, peace out.